Hi, I'm Rick Mixter with a look at what happened on the Great Lakes during the month of December. Buoy tenders like the Sundew have worked the lakes since World War II, breaking ice and maintaining our system of navigational buoys that mark channels and dangerous shoals. On December 4, 1989, the 180-foot buoy tender Mesquite was picking up a buoy near the Keweenaw Peninsula of Upper Michigan when it ran into the rocks and settled on the bottom. The crew was taken off the ship, but Mother Nature quickly destroyed anything of value. It was cut up and sunk in deep water as a dive attraction. I'm critical of the captain and especially the engineer. It was his responsibility to set up damage control central. He didn't do that. The crews that were manning the pumps and setting up the perimeters and had the chance to save the ship, they should not feel guilty because the ship was lost. They never backed it full with full power. They were concerned about destroying the engines and yet they lost the ship. Today, Mesquite rests quietly in 110 feet of water, and many of the artifacts left by the crew are still aboard, protected within the Keweenaw Underwater Preserve. You can learn more about Great Lakes Coast Guard cutters with my documentary, Cutter Rescues. It's available at your favorite library, dive shop, or museum, or find it online at lakefury.com. I'm Rick Mixter. We'll see you next month.